good morning vlog it's saturday morning right now it's 9 30. i wanted to wake up way earlier but i'm so tired today today uh it's a cleaning day so i will have to oops i will have to clean the whole apartment today this is really high on my priority list uh, everything is a mess I haven't been cleaning for the past two weeks so today we really need to do it first thing to do I am going to make breakfast because I'm really hungry and breakfast is actually my favorite meal of the day I have a very big breakfast I love it during weekdays, I normally have hot meal. I will show you probably on Monday. Or uh, at weekends, I prefer to have Greek yogurt with muesli. So today we're gonna use this Greek yogurt. I think this is my favorite actually, is Greek yogurt with honey. And it's very good, very tasty. I'm lactose intolerant, so I need to pay attention with dairy products but this is absolutely very good inside I'm gonna put these oatmeal like it's a muesli package normally I buy the berries one but uh, the berries one was two Swiss francs more expensive actually I'm trying to save a little bit of money so this is basically the same it was discounted five Swiss francs instead of 790 um, so today we're gonna try this Inside, I'm also gonna put some uh, almonds. Uh, these are already cut almonds. These are very good. I use them also um, in my oatmeal. Goji berries. I buy this one in Italy because they are much cheaper. So every time that I'm in Italy, I buy one or two packages. These are very good, very healthy, super food. And I'm also gonna put some chia seeds inside. Um, these, all these three ingredients I also put uh, daily in my hot meal. So let's get started. First, I'm gonna cut the muesli. I bought it yesterday, it's a new package, so still unopened. Perfect. So, not very big plans for today um i am going to clean my entire apartment this is very important because next weekend i have friends over they're gonna stay here they were before living in switzerland and then they moved to germany they moved back to germany because um the boyfriend of my friend find a, ger uh, a job back in germany so they had to move and next week they're coming back here, so they're staying at my apartment, so I really want it to be clean. What I do is, I normally take this big bowl, this is my favorite bowl, it's a Christmas bowl, but I actually use it every day also for my old meal, so it doesn't really matter if it's Christmas or not. morning vlog and welcome back to my channel it's Sunday morning it's currently 10 46 a.m. and I don't know what to do with my life um, the plan for today is actually to um, learn a little bit of what I'm learning right now which I cannot tell you yet but you will know in probably three weeks and I would like to cook for today and for the week if possible um, I will have a, lo a very long and stressful weeks that's why I would like to prepare some lunch in advance 
and I really would like to go to the gym because I have gained one kilo in the past two weeks and no, I cannot get on like this. I really need to start doing sport again. I've been always a very sporty person. I used to play badminton, I used to play basketball, I used to play ultimate frisbee and I used to go to the gym a lot more often than now. Um, since I started my current job, I have had to work long working hours and that's why all my other interests have started to fade away. So my goal for 2020 is to go back to all the healthy habits that I had before uh, starting my current job. 2019 has been a very good year in terms of traveling. I've visited, I have my little list of countries that I have visited. I visited Germany, Italy, England, Denmark, Sweden, France, Austria, Jordan, Liechtenstein, Scotland, Switzerland of course, Norway and Canada. Wow, I really cannot believe this. Like I have been to so many places I have I, I was able to travel so much and yeah I'm, I'm so if I look back at this year like I've traveled I've seen so many new places it has been amazing I know that you went wonder sometimes how can I afford to travel so much you all think oh she works in Switzerland she's millionaire she has a lot of money this is not the truth. Um, I do live in Switzerland and I do have a good salary, but we don't have, we cannot forget that Switzerland is also a very expensive country. I pay a lot in rent, I pay a lot in health insurance, I pay a lot for any other thing that I do, like a normal um, uh, shopping, grocery shopping for two days really costs like 80 euro for me. So. I do have a good salary, but everything is pretty much expensive in Switzerland. Um, I try to limit my expenses, which means I don't go and eat out very often, like on weekends, maybe I just go out for a drink or I just go out to eat with a friend once in a month or twice in a month. And I really pay attention to my expenses. I try to save as much as possible. I cook all my lot. Uh, recently, one of my goal um, for this year were to stop eating out also during lunch because it's easily 15 euro per lunch. So I stopped doing that. I started to cook a lot more at home and that's how I got the chance to save a lot more money, money that then I could spend on travels. And I always plan a lot in advance, so I always book tickets in advance. Of course, some tickets were more expensive than others. For example, Canada were uh, more expensive than, than Oslo, than uh, Scotland. And um, I always book on booking, for example, when I travel alone, and that's why I've been booking with booking.com for years and that's why now I have pretty good discounts. For example, when me and my sister went to Barcelona last year, I managed to get a four star hotel at a very, very good price. I had like 50% discount on that and that was like amazing. We had a four star hotel at the price of a normal three star hotel. So stick to a booking website and when you book like a lot with this then you get also a lot of discounts guys i love this thing so much this is my moleskine planner i really love it i am it's i think the third this was the second year and i already bought one for next year always red but with the soft cover not with the hard cover this is absolutely amazing. Like, I don't know what I would do without this. I really literally write any kind of appointment that I have, any kind of travel. It's especially useful this year for work because I have a lot of like meetings and stuff like that. And 
I, I don't remember anything. I don't remember any birthday. I don't remember any appointment. And I don't really like like those online calendars because every time you have to sign in, you have to synchronize all the devices that you have. So this is absolutely perfect. I really love it actually. And I found, I don't know if you can see it, like, let me show, this little sticker that you can like it holds the pen so i don't know I, I really love it i'm happy because i already bought the one for next year so i really can't wait for next year actually it's like new year new life um there is some things that i would like to achieve in 2020 some things that i'm planning that you will probably know very soon and i don't know like a lot of wishes a lot of hopes um yeah let, let's see i will be able to talk to you in a few weeks about all my plans all my intentions for 2020 um yeah right now i'm still in that phase in which okay do i really want to do that do i do i don't know like i'm i'm really carefully looking at different options and yeah let's see okay so um i think this is it for today i have no idea how long this video is so yeah maybe i will vlog today at the gym a little bit um and i will see you in the next vlog bye